Viper completely destroys the game. And one of the reasons I say that is because watch is DPS. This is without any buffs going on, just base DPS. I know I'm using a lot of high tier items, but honestly, the difference between this setup and a setup you can actually get in game isn't that different. And with just 50 bullets and about one second, we are at 7,000 damage. And that is without any buffs. So if I pick up movement speed and gun buff, I'm going to slide a bit further too as well. Um, I'm going to pick up vampiric bird here. Curse him. And it's just, it's just such a ridiculous amount of damage. Yeah, 7,500 damage in like literally a second. This guy's DPS at base, this guy's DPS at base is 200 damage per second. So if you're like in laning phase, you get up to somebody, they just die. They literally just die. Anyways, I have a pretty insane gameplay for you guys today. I believe I get like 17 kills. Before we get into the crazy gameplay, I'm asking everyone to go down there and subscribe. I'm really trying to get to 1,000 subscribers and I really appreciate everyone who does it. It really does help me out quite a lot. Actually, I get 16 kills. Another thing I want to point out here is I got 30,000 objective damage. Compare that to anybody else on my team or even the enemy team. Nobody even comes close. And this is just because at the end game, I literally slide into the patron and kill it in like five seconds. It's literally ridiculous. Now, I do have quite a bit of deaths here because in the early game, I was bullying everybody. So everybody built slow hex, built curse and suppressor i built everything to make me slower so i couldn't slide and they all focused me and targeted me also i wasn't playing that serious so i didn't decide to like get unstoppable or debuff or move or anything so i kind of threw a little bit in the end game other than destroying the patron kind of just clapping everything but this is hero this is hero labs like this ain't rank so it's fine but it is still very funny to watch how easily I just go in and insta-kill everybody and just cause a whole bunch of havoc in their base, in their face, and everything like that. Alright, so without any more yapping, we're here, we're going into lane. I'm going to be laning with Kelvin, and I'm going to be laning against an Infernus and a Wrecker. Now, Wrecker is actually really powerful, so you got to be careful of him. Also, Infernus uh, is an S-tier hero, so... Basically, off the jump, 150 damage, plus I hit my ability to him. So, just instantly, off the bat, got Wrecker to half HP. It's kind of too far to like really do a lot of damage uh, there. But I jumped down, a little more damage here, find Wrecker, and hit a slide. And off the bat, just insta-kill. Another quick 100-something damage to him. Uh, well, the main problem, as you can see, with Viper is his range. But when you have this much damage, it doesn't matter. Also, his slide boost just makes it super easy to get in close. So here, I basically almost kill in Furnace, but it, a Wrecker kind of jumps in and uh, I have to leave. But I do believe I get like an assist on him. Yeah, I got the assist on him. Almost killed him there, but my Kelvin picked it up for me. Basically, almost killed the furnace. He was literally like 5 HP. But also, just look at this Guardian damage here. With So early on, with two items, straight to the Guardian doing that much damage is not even funny. Already like 20% destroying on the Guardian in like two minutes of the match. It's actually hilarious. Another quick 150 damage, plus his like second ability, which does 90 damage. It's the damage is just insane, but early on isn't really the fun part of everything. So I'm gonna skip ahead here, getting into a little bit of a fight within Furnace. There, his boomerang and his second ability are pretty strong, but they're kind of just like whatever. Kind of just run in here with a slide. Here comes a wrecker. I jump up, hit him with a boomerang, and spray him with some bullets. My second ability does quite a lot of damage, and slide in and miss basically everything, but. I don't know what I was aiming at there. <laughs> I think I was lagging, if I remember right. But look at that. 420 damage in, like, literally, like, a second on the Infernus. It's it's ridiculous, and I'm at four items at this point. Honestly, it is just crazy. And just like that, look at all that objective damage. 500. And look how much stamina I have. I can just run from these guys for, like, ever. They thought they could kill me, but... It's just too much stamina. But yeah, just four items in the game and just insta-killing guardian. Seven minutes in. 
Some of these people haven't even touched the guardians in their lane, but I already destroyed mine. So yeah, I'm going to be skipping ahead a little bit here again, just because we're just looking at the funny uh, smack people in the face, get free kills. But also look how easy he farms. It's so satisfying. It's so insane. But yeah, we're about 10 minutes into the match. I got seven items. Here's Wrecker. Basically no damage at range, but up close here, 400 damage. I don't, he misses his all, just runs away and <laughs> just gets insta-killed. So yeah, with Viper, you have to make sure you're hitting your slides. Otherwise, you're going to be stuck in a reload and get destroyed. But as long as you're sliding, you have so much damage and shoot so much of bullets, it's not even funny. So here's Lash. Quick 180 damage, like instantly. He's going to start like flying in the air, so I can't really do damage. Hit him with a second ability. I'm going to come around with some stamina. He's going to ult me gonna do quite a bit of damage but first ability second ability running around in the air Kelvin did come up to back me up but I probably had that to be honest uh, the only problem was he was getting up in the air getting out of my range my damage range so Lash could be a counter to Viper anything with a lot of movement to kind of prevent Viper from getting up and close and doing a ridiculous amount of damage or anything with stuns, like uh, Kelvin would be really good against Viper because the Arctic Beam would stop him from sliding. Anyways, I find a Magician, hit him with my ultimate. Had a quick reload, a quick burst of a ridiculous amount of damage. And wait for him to come push me. He pushes me. Hit him with my melee and a couple... Not my melee, my first ability. <clears throat> a couple hits to the head. So here we find a McGinnis. And she's gonna try to jump me with her turrets and melees. Hit her with my two abilities. Here comes a Kelvin, and I come back in with a slide. Dead. Reload. My Kelvin ults for some reason and slides. I am there's two there, and I am half HP, so I kind of reposition. Find a wrecker and slide and hit him for like 400 here already. Quick 100. Terrible aim, but. Lied, he tries ulting, just insta killed him. Here's an Infernus, he's just gonna run though, so fun stuff. Same with Lash, but I'll just decide it's not gonna be worth fighting, especially Lash. He can stay with outside of the damage range, so. So I walk up into a team fight, hit a slide, but McGinnis walls, but she drops her wall, so I just try to go back in there, but I got stunned. She got lifted, got the kill assist. Just continue sliding around, spamming bullets. Here's a lash, hit him with a boomerang. Here's the walker, just insta delete it. And here's a wrecker. Uh, he did stun me to get me out of my uh, ability. Again, spray him in the face with my infinite ammo and destroy him. I'm gonna be skipping ahead a couple, uh, a little while, just cause we're back into a team fight. But shortly after this, everyone starts spamming slowing hex, suppressor, a knockdown, and all that sort of stuff. Just because I was kind of bullying these guys. So here's a wrecker. He does stun me. And I go up and around. Which, speaking of suppressor, there's a suppressor on me. And get disarmed by magician. And hit him with my first ability, insta kill. Here's a McGinnis to slide in. Uh, volley of bullets, reload. She just dies. So shortly after this, I'm like, all right, I have a slight bit of bullet life steal. I could probably kill the guardians. This is without life leech, but I just have a silly amount of like DPS. And look at that, <laughs> 3,000 damage in a second. And this is only 20 minutes into the match with 20,000 souls. 3,000 damage a second at 20,000 souls. So here's Wrecker. He stuns me. I've uh, tried doing something here. I just get disarmed though. Slide back around. Destroy magician. Try running a little bit. Uh, tried getting full bullets again. Here comes McGinnis. Gonna be a problem. Get fried by the patron a bit. And I get ulted on. Not really anything I could do there. But uh, I, you know, I destroyed the guardians and tested out my damage. They can't bully me forever. And here is a magician. 
Fleet foot reload, slide in, dead. Uh, there's a wrecker there, but I go for the furnace for some reason. Get a kill assist on him. There's a wrecker. Quick thousand damage. Barely even looked at him. Destroy the guardian. Destroying the other one. 400 damage. That's just insane. It's honestly silly. Look at this shrine damage. Oh my god. Uh, it's so stupid. More shrine damage. Ends to kill the shrine. McGinnis all not really survivable it was slowed here kill assist and basically they kind of just oof my uh fire rate too so i can't do anything i try running up here so i can hit a slide but i get stunned and then yeah anyways after destroying the shrines i thought it'd be funny just to come in here and oof the patron which look at that damage eight thousand look at the patron i literally did 80 percent of the patron in a second but I do get like insta fried by the McGinnis. McGinnis is actually kind of rich. But uh, honestly, I just did a little prank there and did 8,000 damage instantly. Anyways, I learned from my lesson of just jumping in there solo with memes. And I come slide in and goodbye, uh, patron. Just kind of instantly fry it. And here in a second, we'll see the patron come down and um, we'll see why this guy is broken. Get a quick kill on McGinnis there for the fun. At less than 300 HP, I come sliding in, clear up all the troops, and start deleting the patron. Look at that, 6,500. 10,000. 12,500. Just a ridiculous amount of damage per second this character does. It's really broken. We'll see how long this character lasts uh, in Hero Test without some changes. But honestly, that was really fun and I thought I'd share it with you guys. But yeah, literally 10,000 damage per second, honestly. Like, not even clickbait. This guy is insane. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed. Please leave a like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.